lo que lo Okay, can you hear me? Yes, no? Yes. yes. Very good. Hello, time. Mr. Gato. Hello, how are you? Fine. You're fine. Nice to see you. I can also see Gabriela, Josue, and Ruth. Great. So, Let me see. Okay, I'm ready. What day is it today? Today is? Who can tell me? Today is? Tell me the date. Monday, Wednesday. Tuesday. Oh, Wednesday what? Wednesday? Wednesday. June 1st. Exactly. We are in a new month. We are starting a new month, month of June. So this is the first day of this month. Let me show you. I already can see Glenda as well and Gustav. Okay. I was talking to Lupita today in the morning. What happened to Lupita Guadalupe? What happened to her? Está incapacitada. Incapacitada. Wow, I imagine. Sí, pude medio uh, hablar con ella hoy en la mañana. Eh, me decía que iba a avanzar con los ejercicios de la plataforma. Yo le digo sí. Pero sí, es operación. Según entiendo, ¿verdad? Yes, yes. Yes, right. So, imagine. Bien, Lupita, por si. Sí. Igual, las clases quedan grabadas. Si está viendo la clase, igual le mandamos un saludo. Y esperamos tenerla pronto. ¿Cómo se dice cirugía? Surgery. 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 She went through a surgery. She went through, a través. She went through a surgery. Interesting. Thank you. You're welcome. Bien, let's start right now. And let me show you this one. This is class number three. We are still in section number one and we are going to cover section number two today as well. So one of the last topics from section number one, it's about WH words, in this case, WH questions with the verb to be. So this is class number three, and this is going to be the first activity for today. Welcome everyone. Let me ask you, did you go to the platform? Have you watched the videos in the platform or no? Teacher. Yes. Y en la plataforma, eh, la, la chica que habla, eh, habla Bien suave, no se escucha. Hay que estar bien pendiente. De It's la a new girl, right? Es una nueva yes. chica, ¿verdad? This is a new girl. So, in the previous courses, we have uh, Jose Sainz, right? But now it's another lady. She's a new girl. But so, I don't listen to the new girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, interesting. Veamos si podemos dar el comentario. Don't worry. You know, I ask yesterday about your book. Pregunté, vamos a tener manual, libro para ustedes, este módulo. Me dijeron que para este módulo sí no hay manual. Okay, dije, okay, there's no, we don't have, right? So that's why we are going to be watching the videos in the platform together and having extra exercises in the class. So you can practice a lot. So, Let's see, let's go to the platform. Let's listen to this new girl and let's see what we have. But don't worry, I will try to explain in case that you don't get what she is saying. 
caso que no entiendan, yo explico, ok? Don't worry. If you see in English, ok, de, antes de compartir, in English we have two type of questions or the most common questions in English are questions with the WH words or questions with the verb to be. If I ask you, si les pregunto, ¿cuáles son las WH words? ¿Quién se recuerda WH words in English? What? Excellent. What? Uh -huh. Where? ¿Qué otra tenemos? Who? Who? Very good. Uh -huh. We, no, we. When? When? Where? Okay, the second one is there. Where? Where? What? Where? Who? When? We, no. Uh -huh. Where? Why? And where? Okay, don't worry. We are going to watch the video. If you don't remember, but you have the idea. You have the idea. So the WH words, they help us to get information. The WH words, they help us to get specific information, right? Specific information. For example, the WH word, what what type of information can we get qué tipo de información obtenemos what mm -hmm. for example what's your name what, what time is, your, is it what time is it what is your favorite color what sports do you like what sports do you practice so what's your you favorite think, food what's your favorite food very good what so we get information this one where what type of information do we get with the wh word where where do you live location very good job location and that is a great question where do you live where are you from where is your classmate where Okay, location, who? What type of information do we get with this WH word? Who, this one? Yes. About the other persons, mm -hmm. other people. Exactly, about people, sobre personas. Who is your favorite teacher? Who is your best friend at work? Who? Is your boss? Who is your um? ¿Qué más les puedo preguntar con who? Who? ¿Quién me ideas? Who is, is Jorge? Who is, who is Jorge? Uh -huh. Who is boyfriend? Who is your boyfriend? Oh. <laughs> who is your girlfriend? Right. So about people. Información sobre personas. And the last one, wind. Wind. ¿Qué tipo de información obtenemos con esta? Wind. Situation. Mm -hmm. If you see, it's time. It's time. time. It's time. When does the class start? O podemos decir también, what time does the class start? When... Are you going to have vacation? When is the concert? When are we going to have lunch together? When, when you go when, to at office. When when do you go to the office, right? When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Very good job. When is your birthday? When do we celebrate Christmas? So about dates, fechas, right? So now let's go to the platform and let's watch the video, right? 
questions with the WH words. WH questions, including the verb to be. Here we go. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to ask and answer questions with B using WH question words. What, who, where, when, and how. First, let's listen to an audio program and then we'll talk about it. WH questions with B. What's your name? My name's Beth. Where's your friend? He's in class. Whose son he? She's my classmate. What are your classmates like? They're very nice. Where are you and Luisa from? We're from Brazil. How are your classes? They're really interesting. When we use WH question words, we want to know more information. Therefore, your answer cannot be yes or no. It is necessary to know the meaning of each word so you know what you're being asked. This way, you will be able to give a correct answer. Okay, I don't know what happened to the video at the end, <laughs> but don't worry. ¿Cuáles nos hacen falta? Ella mencionó varias. Which are we still missing? De nuestra lista nos hicieron falta dos. Look, let's How? go back. What, where, who, when? ¿Cuáles nos hacen falta? How? Yes, how. Is there any other? Why? Okay, me parece. Why? Let me tell you. Estas son, no son todas. Hay muchas WH words, pero estas son las que nos sirven para obtener information. Right. So, how? How? What type of information do we get with the WH word how? Mm -hmm. What type of information can we get? ¿Qué tipo de información obtenemos? How? How? How are you? It's common. For example, the most common question. How are you? How are you? How are you? How? Is it going? ¿Qué tipo de información obtenemos con how? In the example, mm -hmm. how do you cook the fish? How, exactly. Like a procedure, una pro un procedimiento en ese caso. ¿Cómo? ¿Ok? Tenemos una respuesta a ¿Cómo? How? ¿Cómo estás? Right. For example, do you like your work? Or how do you like it? How do you like it? ¿Cómo te gusta? ¿Te gusta? Yes or no? And why? This is a very specific reason. We need to get this type of information and to give a valid reason. Do you like Mondays? No, I don't. Why? Do you like uh, going to the movies? Yes, I do. Why? Uh, because I spend time with my friends. So, if you see, we are going to make in this, this type of exercises, questions with the WH words, but at the same time using the verb to be. Si les pregunto, ¿cuál es el verb to be? Or what are the three forms of the verb to be in the simple present? Yes. What is the verb to be? Simple person. Mm -hmm. Is, art. Bien. Is, are, and. Is, are. We are missing one. I am. I am. Um. Um. So, siempre que les pregunten, oh, verb to be. ¿Cuál es el verbo to be? O el verb be. Am. Um, is. Are in the present. How about in the past? In the past, what is the verb to be? Was. Bien. Was and. 
Where? In where? Well, don't forget, please. Este es el verbo to be, el famoso verb to be, right? Am, um, is, are, in the present, in the past, was, and were. So, in this case, we are going to use verb to be in the simple present or in the present form. So, if you see, we have been practicing to use the verb to be in a short form. Estamos practicando mucho eso, el uso de formas contractadas, short forms. Right. Take a look at the first question. Who can read? Glenda, can you read the first question, please? This one. Where's your friend? One more time, please. Where's your friend? Very good. So, is Glenda saying where is or is she saying where's? Where's your friend? My friend is Janira. Okay, so where's, ah, but wait. Miren lo que estamos preguntando. Where, about place. ¿En dónde está? Si no, hubiéramos preguntado, who's your friend? Where is your friend? My friend y, ¿cómo digo está? Is my my friend is in trabajo. Mm -hmm. Is at work. So where? Primero preguntemos who. Who is your friend? My friend is. Where is your friend? My friend is. If you see. Recuerden que el verbo to be significa ser o estar. Entonces, en este caso, la misma respuesta. My friend is, para referirnos que es mi amiga y dar su nombre, en my friend is at work. Misma estructura para decir que ella está. Right. So, where is your friend? He's in class. He is at work. He is at home. Those can be very similar responses. What is your friend? He's in class. She's in class. Question number two, Jorge, read question number two and the response, please. Who is so him? Mm -hmm. She is my classmate. Okay, Jorge, who is Rita? Who is she Rita? Is, uh -huh. She is my classmate. Okay, very good. No. <laughs> Rita, who is Janira? It's my partner, the word. Very good. So, Alberto, who is Ruth? It, it, she is my partners in the world. Okay, very good job. So, who is? He is or she is? Let's, she is. Uh -huh, let's try to use the she short is. form. She is. She is my classmate. She is my classmate. Very good. Uh, Alberto, please help me out to read this example. This one. Uh, okay. What What's is See you, see you like. Mm -hmm. Seul like. Seul like. Mm -hmm. It's a very exact existing city. Ah, okay. So you see, in this case, thank you, Alberto. Mm -hmm. We are using the WH word and we are also including the expression like. Like. What's El Salvador like? ¿Qué tipo de pregunta es esta? What's Seoul like? What's El Salvador like? ¿Qué sería like en este contexto? ¿Cómo es? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo es? es? Uh -huh. ¿Cómo es? Right? No si te gusta uh -huh. o no. No. ¿Cómo es? ¿Cómo luce? ¿Cómo es? Right. So if I ask you how, 
No, usemos what siempre. What's El Salvador like, Gabriela? What's El Salvador like? Um, it's a very beautiful uh, country. Ah, very good. We are talking about a place. We are using it. But what if I ask you, ¿qué si les pregunto sobre una persona? ¿Será que vamos a responder con it's? What? Your classmate. Like, ¿cómo es ella? ¿Qué tipo de respuesta daríamos? What's your classmate like? Digamos, what? She is a very romantic. <laughs> what? Pongamos una girl y un boy. Give me two names. Deme dos nombres. From your classmates. Lorena. Okay. Lorena. <laughs> How about boy? Boy? L. <laughs> okay, okay. Mr. Cashpal. <laughs> Why do you <laughs> romantic in the office? I, I need to know about that yesterday. Eh, I need to know what's Ellen Nilsson like. Bien, damos dos respuestas. What's Lorena like? What's Ellen Nilsson like? So, si se fijan, like in this case to describe people. ¿Qué utilizamos para describir personas? What do we use? Uh -huh. What's Lorena like? Uh -huh. ¿Qué utilizo para describir a alguien? Ah, she is friendly, she is nice, she is beautiful. ¿Qué utilizo para describir personas? Utilizo nombres, Adjetivo. verbos. No. Ah, yes. Adjetivos. Adjetivos. So. Okay. Look at the example. Miremos en el ejemplo. Exciting. Mm -hmm. This is an adjective. Entonces, si yo pregunto, what is Lorena like? I am going to use adjectives. Adjetivos, of course. Positive adjectives. Adjetivos positivos, no negativos. Bueno, it depends, right? Si ustedes también quieren usar. Don't worry. So, what's Lorena like? She is. Uh -huh. She is a friendly. She mm -hmm. is. She's friendly. She's friendly. Give me some other adjectives. She's friendly. Uh -huh. Funny. She is funny. <laughs> yes. That's it. Nice. She is nice, okay. What's Ellen Nilsson like? What's Ellen Nilsson like? He is a very ah. romantic. Oh, really? He's a very romantic guy. Okay. Teacher. Interesting. Yes. How do you say uh, hiperactivo? Uh, yes, uh, Janira. How do you say hiperactivo? Hiperactivo. <laughs> Hyperactive. Hyperactive. <laughs> really, Ellen Nilsson. So he's romantic. He's hyperactive. What else? Tell me more about Ellen Nilsson. He's funny. Yes, Ellen Nilsson is. Uh-huh. I'm listening. Yeah. Yes, Carlos. Really, he's an extrovert, right? Interesting. So. You say binary. Okay. He's a dance. ¿Cómo iremos este adjetivo? Dancer. Yes. Bailarín. Dancer. Dan, dan, oh, dancing guy. Dancing man. Dancing Regional, guy. Mexica. Okay. So, <laughs> what's he like? Okay. Don't worry. No, no, más Ellen Nilsson. Right. Here we go. Se apagó, dice la cámara, el micrófono. No, no, don't worry. So, what's like? Si está claro esa parte, where's, who, and what's? Yes, right? Where are? Where are? It's very similar. 
But in this case, we are using plural. We have an example with where is, singular, and we also have an example with plural. Where are you and Vanessa from? We're from Brazil, right. And now look at this example, how? How are, how are your classes? They're pretty interesting. How are your classes? They are pretty interesting. Ah, estamos preguntando de cosas. Preguntemos sobre personas. Hey, um, let me see. Carlos, how are your co-workers? Compañeros de trabajo, co-workers, yes. How um, are your co-workers? They are uh, energetic. Okay, energetic people. Yeah, energetic. Si se fijan, si estoy preguntando sobre personas, siempre uso adjetivos. So, how are your co-workers? ¿Cómo son sus compañeros? How are your clients? Who can tell me? Sus clientes. How are your clients? People who is calling. Me, people miss, who is. Yes. Miss, what Down. is correct? The customer or client? It depends. Depende. El client puede ser like the big boss, el jefe mayor, right? El jefe de una compañía, that's a client, le llamamos así, el cliente, right? Por ejemplo, el dueño de Tigo, el dueño de Claro, es el cliente, es el jefe de todos, right? So, customers son los que obtienen el producto que nosotros ofrecemos, right? Por ejemplo, nosotros de Tigo, Claro, somos los customers, nosotros recibimos el servicio. But the client is like the big boss. So that is the difference. Por eso le llamamos el cliente. El cliente es, en este caso, eh, de, depende de su producto. ¿Quién sería, en su caso, su cliente? The client. ¿Quién es okay. el cliente? Who is the big boss? ¿Quién es el jefe? The big boss, the clients. And the customer serían las personas que reciben el servicio. Right. So, se me borró, creo que la pregunta. So, let me ask you, how are your clients? How are your customers? ¿Cómo son? How are they? Or how is the client? I need to listen to you. How is the client? How are your customers? Yeah, let me listen to you. ¿Con qué tipo de personas se relacionan on a daily basis? Yes, Ivania, how are your clients? Ay, es que no entendí muy bien la, la explicación entre las diferencias. Vale, les ponía un ejemplo para que no se nos olvide. Les decía, pongamos de ejemplo... Uh, this company, this very big company. ¿Saben ustedes quién es el dueño de Claro? ¿Cómo se llama? Who's American the... Motor. Carlos. Slim. Carlos? Slim. Carlos Slim. He owns the company. Él es el dueño de la company. So, él sería nuestro client. Nuestro cliente. Así se le llama. Nosotros le debemos información. ¿A quién? Al client, al cliente. ¿Quiénes son los customers de Claro? Ivania, ¿quiénes son los consumidores de eh, of the services from Claro? We are the customers. We are the customers. Bien, entonces ustedes también tienen que hacer la distinción. ¿Quién es para ustedes el cliente? El que dirige la compañía. El que está a cargo puede ser jefe regional incluso o eh, a nivel de compañía. So, who is the client for you? And who are the customers? ¿Quiénes son entonces los customers para usted? Right. Is it clear now, Ivania? So, so. <laughs> so, so. Don't worry. Okay. 
express yourself. ¿Qué parte no queda clara? Es importante aclarar dudas. Yes, tell me, Vania. Por ejemplo, en nuestro caso, a veces cuando nos escriben nuestros agentes del exterior, se refieren a nuestros clientes con ambas palabras. Ok, Entonces, agentes, agentes del exterior. O sea, ajá, que... bueno, nosotros trabajamos con importaciones. I, ok, I get it. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Entonces, cuando nuestros colegas nos están hablando sobre nuestros clientes locales, se refieren como client o como customer. Como customer. Mm, uh -huh. Ok, I see. Maybe, y no precisamente al, al yeah, dueño, ¿verdad? No es precisamente al dueño. Yeah, you see. Uh -huh. Yes, but tal vez es otra forma de referirse, pero cliente, cliente en sí. Eh, bueno, representante es idea, en el, el representante, exterior. Representante. Tomémoslo así, representante, entonces. Representante. Uh -huh. okay. Como alguien regional. Right, también puede ser. Un representante. But don't worry. Muchas veces eh, se confunde por la traducción al español, que nosotros siempre para nosotros son clientes en español, ¿verdad? Ellos son mis clientes, right? But in English, sometimes it's different. Diferente. But don't worry. Keep on calling these people customer. Llamémoslos entonces customer, right? But that was not the idea. La idea era describir cómo son, usando how are. How are they? ¿Cómo son ellos? How are they? Are they nice people or not? Are they friendly people or They're not? They are demanding. They are demanding. Wow, well, I can't imagine. <laughs> they are demanding. I see. Right. So, how are? Para que entiendan esa pregunta. No cómo están. Cómo son. Okay. How are your classes? Como son, right. What are your classmates like? Eso ya la discutimos. So, just to conclude this idea. Concluyamos. Miren la estructura. WH word. ¿Qué le sigue? Plus. Para la pregunta. WH word plus. There to be. La forma del verbo to be. Plus. A complement. Complement. Mm -hmm. Right. El complemento puede incluir obviamente el sujeto y algún comentario extra. Ok. How about for the answer? Para la respuesta. También utilizamos el verbo to be. Depende de lo que esté utilizando. Mi pregunta ha sido hacer mi respuesta. Where is? Miren, utilizo is. So, in my reply, I need to use is. Who is? Whose? ¿Qué utilizo en mi respuesta? The same. She is. Ok. Look, where are? Oh, this is plural form. So, in my response, I need to give the same uh, verb, right? Verb to be in plural, are. How are? No puedo decir they is or she is, no, porque me pregunta en plural, right? What are your classmates like? They are. So, It is always necessary to match that information. If I'm using verb to be is for the question, I need to also give a response with the verb to be in the same way. Right. Questions about this? Preguntas sobre este ejercicio o nos vamos a la práctica? Or can we go to the practice? Questions or can we continue with the practice? Pregunta, chicos. Don't be afraid to, to say, teacher, can you repeat that? Or teacher, I didn't get it. 
Para eso son las sesiones, para aclarar dudas. So, is it clear? Yes or no? Class, I feel alone. Me siento sola en esta clase. What happened to For you today? Me, it's clear. Okay, that's what I need to listen. Is it clear? Yes, no. Can we continue to the next activity? Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Oh, now I can breathe. Ya puedo respirar tranquilo. Class, come on. Teacher, es que es martes. Right. Let me ask you, how was your morning? ¿Cómo estuvo su mañana? Wednesday, teacher. Wednesday. It's not Tuesday, it's Wednesday, right? Very tired. Very tired, right? The same here, you know, same here. Uh, in my case, yeah, as I, I don't know if I have told you, pero en mi caso también me toca eh, intercambiar información con mucha gente, you know, to be texting people, emailing people, taking calls as well. So sometimes it's very tiring. I understand, you know, but don't worry. This is going to help you a lot. So let's go to the group. Look, we have some exercises that we are going to complete right now. If in case that you need help, please let me know. Let me show you the exercises. Okay, WH questions with B. Try to identify the information the question and then look for the correct response. Six, well, five exercises, five different responses. Lean bien la pregunta, identifiquen la información que vamos a obtener con esa pregunta. Right. So, let me give you five minutes. Cinco minutos, trabajamos con ese ejercicio. Here we go. Okay, let's go. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Very good job. Okay, I'm just missing Glenda. There we go. No deja compartir acá esto. Ah, okay. I forgot to. Please, can you can uh -huh. you repeat about the instruction? Of course, of course. So, let's go and read. Ya lo dejo compartir. Right. Depende de la pregunta o de la WH word, así vamos a obtener la información. Dijimos que con who, ¿qué tipo de información obtenemos? About people. 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 Where. Person. Play. 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 Mm -hmm. What, este es bien general. Casi no hay como una definición que obtenemos con what. Pero miren, preguntas sobre amigos. Friends like. ¿Cómo son tus amigos? ¿Ah? ¿Qué tipo de información mm -hmm. obtenemos? Adjectives, a description of friends. For number four, we have places. For number five, who? ¿Quién? So, necesitamos una respuesta con personas. And number six, the same. We have what and we have yes. his name. So, I need to find out for the name of this boy. Right. So, así va a ¿no? Siempre que vean una WH word, identifiquen qué tipo de información es la que van a obtener. So, mm -hmm. les dejo compartir. ¿Quién me hace? Tengo que salir de acá. ¿Quién me hace? Con? Vamos a poner la F. Okay. Where, where's your t-shirt? Mm -hmm. Okay. Dice, 
She's from South Korea. Korea. Where is your teacher? ¿Dónde está tu profesora? Ajá. Tu profesor, profesor. No es... ¿Dónde está? Dice? Ah, no, yes, no. Ah. Where she from? Yeah, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. She from South Korea. He's in mm -hmm. class. Vaya. Okay. Mm -hmm. In. Y. Um, what are your friends like? Like. They are really nice. What are your friends like? Yeah. Um, they're. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? they? My brother and my sister. Letter C. Letter C. And six. What is this name? ¿Cuál es su nombre? His, his, name, his name is Daniel. Daniel. La, D, la, la, la D es la 6. Sí. ¿Y la, la 5 cuál dijo? La de sí. Estamos entonces. Yes. Este, ¿cuál, la dos, ¿cuál es, Rita? Le, eh. ¿Y la tres? A. Ah. That's our new classroom. No. Okay. Where's your teacher? Where's your teacher? He is in class. He. In this case. Finish. He. She is. She is in class. What are your friends like? Um, they are really nice. They are really nice. Where's she from? Uh, she is from South Korea. Yes. Who are they? Um, they are my brother and sister. Okay, and what's what's his name? His name is Daniel. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Okay. Ahora pregúntame. Okay. Espérame. Que te escuché la pronunciación a teacher. Ya aprendiste alguna. What's that? Okay. That's your new classmate. Where's your teacher? He's in class. What are your friends like? They are really nice. Where's she from? Where's she from? She's from South Korea. Who are they? They are my brother and sister. What is his name? His name is Daniel. From South Korea. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Excellent job. Excellent. I really like Thanks, that. Teacher. Right. Very good job. Did you finish? Yes. Yes. So let's go to the main session. Okay. Vámonos okay. a la sala principal. Excellent okay. job. Let's go. Hi, Carlos. What happened? I'm fine. You're and fine. You? I'm pretty good, you know. I'm hungry. <laughs> uh, not really. Yeah, I didn't have lunch here. Means I need you. Uh, I need to talk with you. Yeah. Uh, in my case, uh, I as sales manager. Mm -hmm. For me, it's very important. It's big uh, under 
in now in English. Yeah, right. It's possible to uh, practice um, with you other, other class. To practice, you need to practice, right? Mm -hmm. You need in to speak and practice, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, Let me see. Let me ask people from English Corporativo if they have like an intensive speaking okay. grammar, right? Because you, I guess you already know all of these grammar sections, but you need to practice more, right? Yes, I, I practice in the moment in the APP, uh, mm -hmm. APP Duolingo is- Oh yeah, nice. right? It's really good. Okay, it's so thank you okay. for asking me. I'm going to ask these people so they can give me a response, okay? Okay. All right. So class, we are back. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. <laughs> hi, hi, Alberto. Listen, how was the practice? Don't worry, in section number two, teacher, we hemos cambiado la section number two, right? No, don't worry. It's a very similar topic, or it's like the, um, la misma eh, continuación, right? Let's like WH word. So, Estamos viendo ahorita abarca section number one and section number two. Right. So you see WH words, we have around 10 WH words in English. Did you know that? But the most used are five. Tenemos casi 10 WH words en inglés. Casi 10, right? So estas son unas cuantas. Eso les decía yo. If you see this exercise, what do I need to do first? How do I know the answer? Easy. I need to identify or to learn what information I'm getting. Para saber cómo responder o qué respuesta es, you need to identify first what information you are getting. ¿Qué tipo de información voy a obtener con esa pregunta? Si no memorizamos esto, va a ser difícil entender qué voy a responder o qué respuesta tengo que identificar. Right. Les decía, with who, what type of information do I get? Who's that? Who's that? Letter F is the correct one. Who's that? Necesito obtener información de qué? De personas. Who's that? That's our new classmate. Right. So, Ruth, number two is for you. Ruth. Please. Hey. Hola, hola. Okay, don't worry. Go. Sí. Hey teacher. Can you read number two? Um, it's a, a. He's in class. Read the question and then give me the answer. Uh, where is your teacher? This is. The request. He's in class. Where is your teacher? Where is your teacher? He's in class. Class, do you have the same response? Or do you have a different option? Or do you agree with Ruth? Están de acuerdo con Ruth. Do you agree yes. with Ruth? Yes. Yes. Where's your teacher? He's in class. Excellent job, Ruth. Let me see. Gustavo, number three. What are your friends like? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, hey, they're really nice. Okay, they are really nice. Do you agree with that class or do you have a different response? Yes. Yes, it's correct. It's correct, yes. right. So number two is letter E and number three is letter A. Ivania, please, let's have number four for Ivania, Eden Nilsson, number five, and 
Gabby, number six. Go, please. Question okay. and answer. Okay. Where is she from? Uh, she is from South Korea. Do you agree with that class? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Very good. Letter She's B. She's from South correct. Korea. Okay, number five. Go ahead. Number five. Who are they? They are my brother and sister. Do you agree with that or do you have a different response? Same. Very good. How about I'm number agree. six? Okay, I'm in agreement. Yes, number six. What's his name? Uh, his name is Daniel. Letter D is the correct. Very good job. So how did you feel this exercise? Easy or difficult? How did you feel it? More or less. <laughs> Easy. Because I'm Easy. going to ask you the same questions right now. Aquí van las preguntas sin verlas en la pantalla. Okay. Let me ask you class. What's her name? What's her name? Oh. Okay. Her name is Elena. Wait, no, no, no. Oh. Voy a poner anclaje. Aquí está, era, no era anclaje, era destacar. What's her name? Um, her, her, name is her name is Janira. Her name is Janira. Her name is Janira. Where is she from? She's, She's from, from, from Spain. Spain. What is she like? She's really nice. Okay. Cool. Ah, no, she but is intelligent. Give, give me the complete No me digan cool, no. She is. She's. Huh? Intelligent. Okay. What are her friends like? <laughs> she likes the hamburger. No. What are her friends like? Her friends or her classmates. What I think, I think that the, her friend is Ruth. No, but in in, in general, her friends, what are her friends like? Como son sus amigos? What are her friends like? Beautiful. Okay. <laughs> In mid sentence, si yo pregunto con what are they friends, tienen que darme respuesta con el verbo to be también, no solo el adjetivo, please. What are her friends like? ¿Cómo son sus amigos? Este. Ustedes her friends son sus amigos. Are, uh, they <laughs> are is funny. They are funny, okay. Mm -hmm. Very they good. They are happy. They are happy, okay. Interesting. Who is he? He is Alberto. Okay, he is Alberto. Where is he? Can you he's, in, he's in. He's, he's in. He's in. He's in operations department. Sure. Okay, interesting. What is he like? Um, he's like. And the beer. No. <laughs> what, what is he like? like? What's he like? He's friendly. He's friendly. What else? Oh. He's he is proactive. He is proactive. Wow. Interesting. He's proactive. Um like Chiroli. Yes, okay. What are his classmates like? You are his classmate. Yeah. So what are his classmates like? Mm. 
¿Cómo son sus compañeros? What are his classmates like? They are, yeah, they are beautiful. Are they are friendly. You are. Son ustedes. Descríbanse. No sacan. They are friendly. Oh, they are friendly. They are great. They are friendly. <laughs> yeah. We are. We are. They are. We no, are. We are. Yeah. Nice. Se dice yeah. onda. <laughs> Onda. Depende si es onda. De... Buena onda. Good ah, de moto, ¿qué? They nice. are good. Onda good nice. Buena. They are no, nice. They are nice. Nice. They are nice. They are nice people, teacher. Right. Son ustedes que se tienen que escribir. They are nice people. Let me ask you about another girl. ¿Quién crees que es? Another girl. What's her name? Her name is her Rita. Name is Rita. When her is, name is uh -huh. Sosibel. I don't know, you tell me. When is her birthday? Um, his birth, her it's birthday her was yeah. on May 30th. Okay, excellent. How is she like? Or what is she like? 28. 28th, Nilsson. Yes, very No, but listen to my question. Listen to my question. What is she uh, like? What is she like? No, how old is she? What is she like? She's pretty. She's friendly. Okay, she's friendly. She's a nice person. She's, really a nice nice. Person. she's kind. She's kind. Where is she from? Teacher, ¿cómo se dice exigente? Demanding. Demanding. She's, She's demanding. <laughs> okay, no, but that's fine. Salvador. Mandalorian. She's from Calma. Salvador. Eso no me piden traducir lo que no sé cómo es. Teacher, curly es colochos. Yeah, she's a curly girl. <laughs> curly girl. Yes. She's curly. She's, she's curly. 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 Well, very good. What are her classmates like? Same question. You are fabulous. You. What are her classmates like? ¿Cómo son sus compañeros? ¿Por qué se me pierden con esa pregunta? They are fabulous. They are really nice. They are friendly. They are very nice. We are intelligent. <laughs> We are this guy. Claro, o sea, The last one. I need to pick a boy. Elijamos a un chico. They are solidarios. ¿Cómo se dice solidarios? How do you say solidarios, class? Eh? Uh -huh. Saquen su inglés. How do we say solidarios? ¿Cómo es ese adjetivo? Solidar. Solidari. No, solidar, solidar. Uh, they are solidarios. No. Ok, yes. Let me have a boy. Ok. What his name? Bien bravo. <laughs> name is Gustavo. 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 His name is Gustavo. Okay, what is his he like? His name Gustavo Álvarez de Sof. What he's like? Mm -hmm. Class, what he's is he friendly. like? He's friendly. He's intelligent. He's intelligent. He's smart. Okay. He's sleeping now. He's sleeping. Okay. Where is he? Is he? Tall. Where's he right now? Oh, really? He's friendly. Tough. You say tall? Tall, alto. Oh, okay, alto. Yo pensé otra. Okay, escucha algo más. Don't worry. <laughs> eh, no, no, sí. Where is he right now? Yes. <laughs> where is he right at this moment? He is in the uh, office. In Informatic in department. Okay, where does he live? He lives in San Salvador. Okay. Who are his friends? <laughs> very, very. Class in English. <laughs> Their friends are very special. Okay. <laughs> okay interesting. <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. Hey, Carlos, man. I don't know. Well. Okay, so Don Carlos, Carlos Daniel. Really? Okay. So class, let's stop here.
paremos acá, eh, ¿cómo se entiende esa práctica? WH words. Si se fijan otra vez, repasamos con ejercicio escrito, pero luego nos vamos a la práctica real, real life. Hablamos de personas, tienen que estar preparados a escuchar y dar la respuesta correcta. Right, les pregunté, la que más les cuesta, who are they like? ¿Cómo son ellos? ¿Cómo son sus compañeros de clase? Tenemos que saber responder really fast. Mañana les hago la misma pregunta al inicio. Be ready to answer that right. We are going to continue tomorrow. I really hope to... Um, you to go and visit the platform. If you have questions about the exercises, please don't hesitate and write me back. So we are going Thank to stop you. the class here. Thank you so much for joining today and see you tomorrow. Thank okay. you, teacher. See you, see you Bye. Tomorrow. Have a great afternoon. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.